Have you ever wondered what secrets Mars holds? Our journey begins with the launch of NASA's Perseverance rover. Propelled into the cosmos with a mission to unlock the mysteries of the Red Planet, Perseverance embarks on a quest to explore Mars, to seek out signs of past life, and to gather invaluable samples from the Jezero crater. This isn't just a rover, it's a mobile laboratory, armed with the most advanced tools and technology, ready to delve into the unknown. With the rover successfully launched, our exploration of the Red Planet begins. Now, let's imagine the rover landing on Mars, ready to start its exploration. From the moment the rover's wheels kissed the Martian soil, it was off to work, investigating the mysteries of the Red Planet. Perseverance, equipped with an array of specialized instruments, began its initial activities. Among these was the Sherlock Ultraviolet Spectrometer, a device capable of detecting evidence of water and organic molecules. It scoured the terrain, its sensors probing the Martian rocks and soil for signs of these life-essential elements. The PXL X-ray spectrometer, another of the rover's scientific tools, was also brought into play. Its job was to analyze the rocks in the Seda Formation, a geological area of interest. The spectrometer searched for signs of watery alterations, changes in the rocks that could indicate past presence of water, a vital ingredient for life as we know it. The rover was not just looking for signs of water, but also for evidence of organic molecules, the building blocks of life. It was a search not just for Mars's past, but also for its potential future. With the first few steps taken, the rover prepares to delve deeper into the Martian landscape. As the rover explores, it collects samples and captures images, revealing a picture of Mars never seen before. The Perseverance rover, a marvel of modern science, has been scouring the Martian landscape, seeking signs of past life. Its journey has led it to the Jezero Crater, a region rich in geological wonders and secrets waiting to be uncovered. Within the crater's confines, the rover's specialized instruments have made some intriguing discoveries. The Sherlock Ultraviolet Spectrometer, a device capable of detecting the faintest traces of organic material, has discovered evidence of water and organic molecules. These are the building blocks of life as we know it, suggesting that Mars may have once been a habitable environment. But the rover's exploration of the Seda Formation has provided even more insights. Here, the PIXL X-ray spectrometer has analyzed rocks and found signs of watery alterations. This is another strong indication that water, a critical ingredient for life, once flowed on the Martian surface. Yet, the search for definitive proof of past life continues. The Mastcam Z stereoscopic camera, tasked with identifying sedimentary rocks that could preserve ancient signs of life, has so far come up empty. However, the rover's journey has only just begun. It has now reached a dried-up delta, a location where such rocks may well be found. These findings give us a glimpse into Mars's past and its potential habitability. Each discovery, each piece of data, brings us one step closer to answering the age-old question, are we alone in the universe? While we may not have the answer yet, the Perseverance rover's mission is a milestone in our quest for knowledge. It's a testament to human curiosity, ingenuity, and our relentless pursuit of understanding the cosmos. But what do these findings mean? How do they contribute to our understanding of Mars and the potential for life? Let's dive in. These findings from the Perseverance rover are significant to say the least. They're essentially adding new chapters to Mars's autobiography, shedding light on a past where the planet was habitable, a stark contrast to the desolate, harsh environment we see today. This information is crucial because it helps us understand the evolution of Mars and by extension, our own planet. The evidence of water and organic molecules detected by the Sherlock Ultraviolet Spectrometer is particularly exciting. Water is a fundamental ingredient for life as we know it, and the presence of organic molecules could suggest that Mars had the necessary building blocks for life to form. The rover's mission to collect samples from the Jezero crater and return them to Earth for further examination is also of paramount importance. These samples will provide us with tangible pieces of Mars that we can study in detail, using technologies and techniques that are not currently feasible on Mars. But perhaps the most exciting aspect of these findings is the potential for discovering life on Mars. Although no direct evidence of past or present life has been found yet, the conditions that once existed on Mars suggest that life could have been possible. If we were to find even microscopic life forms in the samples from Mars, it would profoundly change our understanding of life's existence beyond Earth. It's important to remember that our search for life on Mars is not just about finding aliens. It's about understanding the conditions that allow life to exist, 
how common those conditions are in the universe, and ultimately, our place in it. Every discovery, every piece of data collected, brings us one step closer to answering the question, are we alone in the universe? We hope you enjoyed this episode and want to thank you for watching. Please subscribe and click the like button along with the bell to be notified when we release new episodes.